What's going on, everybody? This is Al from PlaybookGamer.com, and today we're back at it with Murray State. And in the last Dynasty video, we took on Akron. We lost by seven. The last couple games have been pretty tough defensively, especially. If you look at the screen there, we're struggling on defense in the first half in particular, and we got to figure out how to fix that if we can. By then, it's just almost too late for us to come back. It'd have to be a minor miracle to get close. And this was an example of how close we can get, but it was just too late by then. So we got to figure out what to do defensively in general. It's going to be a really hard. It's For me personally, it's hard, harder to scheme up defensively around your talent as opposed to offense. Offense is way easier, but defense... Sometimes it is what it is. You just have to grin and bear it. That's why we try to run as much clock as we can so our defense doesn't have to put so much weight on itself to try to get the job done for us. But we got to keep playing. <clears throat> Today, we are taking on Notre Dame. This is one of the games I probably shouldn't have scheduled, but and it's neither here nor there. But they got a lot of talent. They're 4-3. and three. They're on a one-game winning streak. And looking at their stats, looks like they are pass-oriented. Brady Quinn, uh, the uh, what's his name, the wide receiver that played, he's a pitcher for the or for the Cubs or was he may not be in the league anymore. Jeff Shamarja, that's his name. They had really good talent that year. That was like the highlight of oh I could see his face now. Uh, the big head coach, I, dang it, Charlie Charlie uh, whatever I forgot. Either way. They got a lot of talent. It's going to be difficult to try to beat them, but we'll try our best. Charlie Weiss is the name. That's right. Charlie Weiss. There you go. So before we play Notre Dame, let's go to... We don't have to worry about recruiting. We have went through that before. We can look at Sports Illustrated, see if there's anything new. Bowl rankings, I don't care. I mean, we can look and see who's kind of doing their thing in the top five or so. Tennessee's up there. That's good to see. But none of that really matters to us. We can go to... Heisman Watch, AP, Reggie Bush, Kelly Clemens, Cody Hodges, and I don't know who this is, Charles Sharon, wide receiver, apparently putting up some good numbers. Wow, 17 touchdowns already. And there's still like, what, three games left on the season? It's good for him. Finally get to see some awards information. I don't think we'll be on any of these. <laughs> I'm quite positive we won't, but we could check here. Let's go back to the Maxwell. Let me just... I'm not going to look at these too hard unless we are on one of these lists. Quarterback, no. Walker, no. Wide receiver. The only thing I could think of we might have a chance is right here. And he's not on the list. I guess he just hasn't done enough. John St. Louis, not enough touchdowns and catches, I'm guessing. I figure he may sneak on there somehow, but it looks like that's not going to happen. Remington. Just quickly going through these. Like I said, I don't expect any one of our players to be on here in any form or fashion. Groza and the punter. Best returner. No. And best coach. We're not on there either. So we don't have to look at the awards all that much unless, like I said, John Sinaloui really cranks it up. You may see him sneak into that tight end award list, but by now it's too late for him to even be considered. Free think substantial. Conference standings, that doesn't matter. Players of the week, I don't care. One thing we can do is go to uh, rosters and playbooks. The playbook is staying the same. We added a bit of a screen game to our offense last game, and I was happy with what I saw, so we're going to continue to do that. That's just going to help uh, alleviate pressure from our run game and give our quarterback, C.T. Eldridge, easier throws than what he was doing before. Because the parachute offense at his purest, it helps to have a quarterback that can make some decent throws, and he just doesn't have that. So we had to work around that, and hopefully the screen game will do that for us. Just quickly looking at the main guys here. Baxter, fullback, he, he doesn't even play. Buckles, some of our guards have gone up a little bit. It doesn't hurt, that's for sure. Junior, I'm just kind of looking. We got a junior, John St. Louis, a junior. We got, we're going to have some bodies coming back next year. We're going to lose biggers. That's going to hurt. But what I want more than anything in the offseason is 
some running backs and maybe a, a better quarterback or two. We got to improve the backfield as best as we can. We need help everywhere, obviously, but that's like the quickest way to really boost up a very bad team. Get them going up, you know, add more program prestige stars is having a backfield. It just makes it easier on you. And we're trying to work around a bad backfield. We can look at program standards. We're still, it's practically at halfway and today is like a perfect day for some guys to get in trouble because we're probably not going to win today. So it'd be like a great time for getting like two or three guys in trouble so we can lower that bar that way we don't have to put as many points in the recruiting or into that and we could put that somewhere else like recruiting. And speaking of what I plan on doing is I'll probably post a couple of these games in a row. Normally I alternate between this and then like a tutorial video and then something else. But the closer you get to the off season, the more excited you get about it. And we're just three games away. So I'm really looking forward to getting to the off season. That's always the super fun part for me. And we're getting close to that. I had my second controller plugged up there, so we don't have to worry about that. Nobody got in trouble, unfortunately. Notre Dame has a few people out. Oh, one thing I didn't look at was the game info or the team info pages. That's okay. I don't think we're going to see anything substantial that's going to help us with this game. That's just something I got to get in a habit of doing. I've just forgot. But they got Zibikowski is out. He's number nine. I remember he was really good. Reggie McKnight. I think that was Reggie. They had some talent back then. Go back to on YouTube. Go to 2005 Notre Dame. They had a really good team. Almost beat USC. Probably should have. And Matt Liner and Reggie Bush and the Bush Push. All that good stuff. That was a crazy game. Okay, we got good weather. This is like our first televised game in, in a month. And it shows the independent standings, which I think is funny. Both Eastern and Western are still winless. That's kind of to be expected. Brady Quinn, not having the best season. Maybe we could bait him into some interceptions today. All right, the pick of Notre Dame as expected. And I want the ball second half just in case we get some momentum towards the second quarter. All right, let's check out their roster. Brady Quinn, 86 overall. Darius Walker is out. That's really going to help. Now, I still expect him to, to throw more. But either way, having this guy out is going to help. Very good fullback. Let's see. Wide receiver. They're top. Rima McKnight, that's their wide receiver, not their running back. Maurice Stovall, Matt Shelton. Where's Jeff Shamarja? There he is. They got him as an 80 overall. That guy was an awesome wide receiver back in the day. Now he was, I think he's still pitching in the league somewhere. Tight end, really good tight end. That tells me they're going to throw quite a bit today. And the stats of what we looked at before showed that. Offensive line, 85, 84, 93, 92, 87, just a killer line. Really small right tackle. Okay, defense, they are a 3-4 team. This is like the third 3-4 team we've faced this year. I've played a ton of them. I didn't think about that. I, I do fine against the 3-4. It helps to have a little bit of talent to go up against it. I always enjoy going up against the 4-3 more, but it is what it is. So as you can see here, they got a really big defensive end there, a decent sized one right there. And oh, let's look at the defensive tackles here. Yeah, their front three looks pretty solid. Linebackers, 82, 80, and 74. You see all these linebackers they have. Show you they run a 3-4. Brandon Hoyt, 87 overall. Corners aren't bad. Would love to have, like, these two freshmen. <laughs> That'd be great. Free safety. Tom Zibikowski would be out for two weeks. So they've just been hit with the injury bug in one form or another, and that's probably the reason why they're four and three instead of, you know, six and one. Chinadum Naduque, 76 overall. So I'm looking for, they don't have, like, they got two impact players out. That really stinks. 
they're still going to give us all we can handle today, I'm sure. They got a decent kicker and not much of a punter. So let's get this show on the road. I can't stand Notre Dame. I've never liked them. I'd love to upset them today. We'll do a high kick, force a fair catch. Don't want any easy returns. Okay, Brady Quinn can't throw or can't run the ball. So we're going to go after him as best we can. <clears throat> so we're going to take a lot of chances, doing a lot of zone blitzes. Oh, wow, that fullback just blew right by me. Blew, uh, ran over me. Let's do quarters. Maybe I can bait him into a pick on the left side. It's like we're going a spread. I'm going to stay uh, here. Get a tackle there. We're doing that. Let's just do quarters from 4-3. I didn't check the scattering report. They may actually run more than I think. Oh, oh, oh I got to show you this. This is crazy. There are three guys wide open here. You look right. Well, when I was right, right here, this guy was open, so I had. I felt like I had to cover him. I was closest to him. Then he had this guy going out in the flat. Then he had this guy wide open. The quarter's covered. I guess that's my fault for not going over to the sideline. Either way, easy completion for them. We'll do a one high man. Get a stop, somebody. Get a tackle. All right, second and eight, possibly. Second and seven. Let's try a zone blitz. Love to get him in a third and long. Don't run up the middle. Oh, man, I thought I had a chance to get him there. Good defense by our impact corner, Gallishaw. So now it's third and seven. It's what we want. What I want to try to do, I'm going to just take a chance on something. It's on my mind, so I'm going to do it. We're going to go with a fire two. We're going to send six guys. I want him to throw quick. I think I don't want him sitting back there all day making a throw. Oh, man, I thought I had him. Oh, I don't think he got it. He didn't get it. Are they going to go for it? They're going to go for it. Dang it. What do you do, you know? We're gonna, we got to do a one high. I can't do all our blitz here. I don't trust him. And there he goes. Easy first down. It was a good effort on that third down, though. I'm doing that. Um, we'll just do one high. They're running the ball more than I expected. Look at that. They're just, they're just going to run all day. Hmm. And we got a player hurt, John Dykes. That is either the defensive end or the linebacker. We got two John Dykes on the team. We'll just do a goal line and be done with it. They should score. And I pressed the wrong button. Dang it, I switched my players. <laughs> ah, he was probably going to score anyways. All right. As expected, they went right down the field and scored. We got him on a fourth down at least, but it didn't matter. So we'll get back on, we'll go on offense for the first time and see if we can maybe tie it up. Right down the middle of the field. I'm just going to take a knee on that one. Let's go. Let's do slam. And out for the game. That's great. So, do we have anybody behind him? I'm pretty sure we don't. 
He's our outside line, left outside linebacker. So we have no linebackers whatsoever. He's our best linebacker, and he's out. So what I may have to do is play a lot of dime, because we at least get some speed out there. And all my fourth, I mean my fourth best corner, is better than my best middle starting middle linebacker right now. So let's say we're gonna play a lot of dime the rest of the way. All right, they're going man. We'll go right. I don't think I got the first. Second and inches. Let's do a screen. We're going man. We're doing that. Eh, just a bad play. It's not the best man beater in the world. It can happen. I mean, you can make good plays off of it if it's man, but works better if it's zone. Let's do. Uh, we'll try halfback out. We're going zone. I hope we can make this. We'll run some clock though. Might as well. This will go to Odom's. Going to play it safe and just pick up the first like that. Let's go to a power shoot concept. We're going man. The clock is stopped, and that's okay. We got the first down. We want to go to Biggers and want to have him touch the ball as best we can. I don't think that any of that's going to work. I was going to do a... Trying to find if I can get to it. We're going to do a slot screen. We're going to go to our tight end on this one. You flip it, you can give it to your tight end. Just a bad throw, though. Not a very good throw. So where are we? We are It's third and one. Uh... Uh, we can. It's, this is. Uh, we can try it. They're going four three. Oh, I'm gonna go ahead and snap this one. Just get the first down with Lane. Yeah. We'll probably do another screen here. They got a guy out for two weeks. We're doing that. I'm gonna bring him down. Get a first down with Deloom. I think I got the first. First ten. We are going to try, let's try. Let's do a draw. They're going man. They're going 4 3. They've been doing a lot. I thought they was a 3 4 team. Maybe I should have scattered before. Oh well. We are going to go to the left. That's just good defense. Shed the block pretty easily on that one. Let's do another screen. We're going zone. We're going to let that clock roll as best we can. This is going to go to Biggers. Hopefully he can make a better throw here. Now, he's a right-handed quarterback. Throwing to your left on screens can be hard at times, but it just depends on the quarterback. Not a bad play. Now, what we're going to do here, this is two-down territory for us, so I'm not worried about getting the first down here. We're going to do another screen. We're going zone, so this will go to Biggers. What I may do is just let the clock roll out, the the big the clock itself, and we'll just go to the second quarter, just in case they decide to go man, because we're going to call this play again in the next quarter. 
So the goal man, I think we got a better chance of getting a bigger play and getting more yards. We're going to try it again. All right, they're still going to go zone. So we'll go to Biggers here. Hopefully we can get a decent game. Ah, terrible throw. What do you do about that? Just a bad throw. Hey, even his screens could be bad on the throws. <laughs> All right, it's fourth and six. We got to go for the first. Now they're going man. That's good. Let's see what happens here. Ah, he dropped it. Ah, he dropped it. That was a good throw, too. That was a great throw. Look at this. Oh, wow, that's good defense. What that is, stupid joystick. I probably should have went to him right there. That was my fault. I probably didn't go to the right guy. I wanted to go to my tight end. I didn't like his separation from the defender, from the safety or linebacker. That was my bad. I probably should have went to somebody else. All right, we'll get back on defense. At least we chewed up a bunch of clock there. I just wish we'd got some points out of it. Easy completion there. I'm just going to stick in quarters. But some teams like to use their intermediate passing game to open up the run. Either way you look at it, it's good balance. Play action. He's got all day to throw, too. Look at this. Ah, what do you do? He's good. Notre Dame's good. A lot better than us. All right, we'll do a zone blitz. Please do not run. Go play action. And I forgot I got played dime. I forgot. I'm, I forgot. I forgot. This will be an easy... Hmm. All right, we got to play dime. I just forgot about that injury. So let's go dime. And let's try. Do we got a basic? There's a fire two, monster three. It's been so long since I played dime. Let's just do quarters for now. They got a hanging tight end, but. Oh, what do you do about that? Look at this. Look at that. We're, we're so bad defensively that Brady Quinn just broke four tackles. Craziness. Nothing you can do about it, though. Did he catch it? I guess he caught it, didn't he? Second and eight. We're going to stay in dime because that's all we can do for now. Let's try. Uh, let's do a, a cover one. Yes, we're going to try this. Nice. It worked. All right, now it's third and long. Third and 13. I don't think there is a... Cover six in this one. I don't see it. So I'm going to go back. Let's, and I pressed the wrong play. Dang it. We're going to call a timeout. I don't know my dime well enough. I haven't played it so long. Uh, let's do cover three switch. I'm going to control a defensive end. Maybe I can get to him in time. Ah, thank you. He's got all day to throw. Good stop. Yes, kick a field goal, please. A flag, though. Hopefully it's holding. We're going to decline that. And make them kick a field goal. So hopefully we could get on offense, go down the field and score. Man, it'd been great if we would have scored that first drive. But holding them to a field goal was pure success. They can have as many as they want. But we got to figure out how to score on offense. At least finish a drive. Let's see if Gallishaw can do something here. 
There's nothing there. A dude shit his block way too easily. Let's go. I'm trying to think. Drags. We're going to do tight end choice. We're going zone. I want to get in my tight end, so that's why I call this play. Looks like we're going to be able to, hopefully. Just bad throw. Threw it way low. Forced the tight end to come back for it. We can stay here. Let's do that tunnel screen again. We're going man. I'm glad of this. I want to do this. Go over the top. Let's go, JSL. And he enters. Dang it. What do you do? Just short armed it. Perfect one on one situation. And just uh, he short armed it. Well, what, I mean, it's, it is what it is. Nothing you can do about it. Let's do a crash, too. And they ran it. Good thing we went with an under front there. And I'm going nickel. Why am I going nickel? I wanted to go dime. I keep forgetting I got to go dime. Interception. Big play right there. Oh, big play. We can go back and look at this. Let's see what happens here. Fake the halfback toss. He just overthrew it. So we're on the left hash. I'm trying to think. We can... We have... Let's do an RPO. It's on my mind, so let's just run it. We're going zone. Now, oh, I didn't think about this. I know he's not going to be good on this throw, so what we're going to do, we'll, we'll just keep this safe and go to our tight end. And just get some yards. I was going to go over the top, but against cover two, but I think I made the better choice there. I would love to run it, but we just, we're not very good at it. We're going man here. He's coming down. Please, I want that other safety to come up. Dang it. Wow, perfect defense. So now it puts us in a third and long. I guess I should have went with something else. So the clock is running. We'll go halfback corner. We're going man. I would prefer to try to go to Biggers here instead. If they go cover one, yeah, they're going cover one at least. I'm going to have him get out of the way. No, let's do this. I just want that safety out of the way if I can. Let's just go over the top and maybe we'll get lucky. Yeah. I just, perfect defense all around. I covered one. I could have went to the comeback. We can look at this. I just don't, tr I mean, we could have gotten a first. I didn't, last time we threw this, I think it was in the last game, he threw an interception. So it's fourth and 10 on the 30. Let's just sky punt it. Not much else we can do there. Just a bad series. Perfect kick. Let's see, he'll definitely throw a catch that. Unfortunately, just defense or offensively, it's just going to be a struggle today, I'm afraid. And it went prevent. Well, it's the same as quarters. We'll go with that. The Fighting Irish. Line up with three wide. Intercept that. Where is he throwing? Jeez, where was he going with that ball? They're trying to keep us in it. Let's walk, look at this. Did he get hit when he threw it? He got hit when he threw it. That's what happened. Look at this. Lame duck throw. That's what happened. 
Okay, so let's try to take advantage of that if we can. We're in the middle of the field. Let's attempt. I'm going to do halfback direct. They'll set up shot at the 44. He's already thrown two picks. All right, they're going man. They're doing that. The racers set up the no, go back this way. And we'll go to the left. He has some room. Get out of bounds. So we're on the 22. I'm trying to think. Let's go. We're going to go safety attack. We're going man. We are going to hot route Whitaker. To a go. And he dropped it. Dang it. He was wide open too. Okay. I want to do... Where's it at? Where's it at? Where's it at? Halfback angle. We're going zone. This will go to Odom's or Biggers. No, or Galashaw, I guess. The clock's running. I'm going to let it do its thing. We're going to do a flanker flip. We're going to do tight end streaks. We're going man. I feel like I got it. No choice but go to Galoom here if we want the yardage. Let's go, GSL. Ah, just overthrew it. We're going to go with a field goal. I hope I can make this. I got a terrible kicker. 34 yards. And I'm just not very good at this, but I want to try to get some points. I just, right now, let's see. Oh, we may get this. Oh, we got it. Good deal. So we're down a touchdown. Please, we got to survive these next 33 seconds if we can. Notre Dame has given us turnovers. We're trying to take advantage of them as best we can. We're going to do another high kick. He's taking this one out. Now, I'm curious to see what they're going to do here. We're going to do quarters. I don't know if they're going to try to make something of this or they just want to go to the half. Yeah, it's a 4-3 defense. They're going to play action. Somebody make a play except that guy overthrew it. Whew. So it looks like they're trying to do something. I'm going to stay in quarters just in case. If I was them, I would just run the ball and go to half. We're going to throw it. Ah, dang it. Okay. He didn't get out of bounds, and he didn't get the first, but they called a timeout, which is interesting. Uh, what do we do here? Uh, we're going to go with a one high. We're going to go with a one high. It's third down and two to go. Ball on the I think they're going to run the ball. The -line shifts over. And they're going to run the ball. That's what I expected. Yeah. Uh, so now they're in a decent position to try to do something. We're just going to go back to quarters and try to keep everything in front of us, hopefully. This is what worried me, is they're going to have plenty of time to, and I pressed the wrong, I think it's, I pressed the wrong guy to cover, or to, to control. And the, yes, I didn't know what they was going to do there. They didn't call a timeout, which I thought was interesting. So we're down a touchdown. This is a victory to me. I mean, for us not be able to score any touchdowns, I'm very pleased with that. We can look at the stats and scores. As you can see here, total offense, 70. Right now, just the offense isn't really clicking. But for somehow down a, a touchdown, that's mainly because of those two interceptions. So we'll take that all day. So now we get the ball started second half, which is the reason why I like to have start with the ball in the second half. Hopefully you can take advantage of it. 
All right, Biggers, let's make a play. Biggers feels it at the two. He's hit and got away. Just don't fumble it. Don't fumble it. Don't fumble it. Let's go. Let's do a power shoot plate or going man. We'll bring him over. We're bringing everybody. Oh, I think it's intercepted. Yeah, I overthrew it. Just overthrew it. Just not a very good throw. We're going to stay here. We're going to do a toss play. Let's get Odom's going if we can. Get the run game going some. We're going zone. I like the shift. We're going to go to our right. The clock is stopped. Big play by Odom's first down. So we got to sprinkle those in as best we can. We're going to do a slot screen. They're going man. They keep going man on our screens. And they're doing that. Let's I'm going to bring him down. Great. And a fumble. How in the world did he fumble that? Let's go back and look at this. This is wild. Great blocking all around. Whether it's man or zone, you just never know what may happen. But we get great blocking. But look at this right here. Somehow he fumbles it. He fumbles. That's just wild. Go back and look at this. Somehow the loom gets on it. Crazy play. Second and in inches, too. Okay, let's go. Let's reward him. Let's go slant outs. They're going zone. So this is going to go to the loom. And the clock is running. Crazy how the clock is running. And we didn't get a first down all because of that fumble. And he got past the yard marker, too. Or the first down marker. Pick up the first there. Let's try. Uh, let's do a slam. We got momentum. Let's see if we can get some yardage off a of run play. They're going man. I'm afraid to go to the... Well, let's do this. Let's go to the other side instead. Just so we are guaranteed to be on a hash. Ah, dang it. JSL, John St. Louis, just I couldn't get around him quick enough. So what is it? It is second and nine. We're going to flip these guys back over. Uh, Yes. We're going to go back to tight end streaks. They're going man against it every time. Every time, which doesn't hurt my feelings, especially if they bring both safeties. The problem is Eldridge is doing a terrible job of hitting the deep ball. We haven't connected on one yet. But they're bringing both of them. Make this one. Ah, it's perfect defense. The deep ball is not working right now. It's third and nine. This is two-down territory for me. I want a manageable fourth down instead. And they're bringing everybody like that. They're doing that. Let's look at my audibles. Do I have these set up? I don't know if I do. And I don't. Let's do that instead. Make a play. Oh, my gosh. What a catch. Oh, this is all kinds of messed up here. Just a crazy play by John St. Louis. I, that was a bad throw on my part. I didn't mean to throw it to him. We can go back and look at this. I, I don't have a gun wide trips audible. So I had to audible to something because I knew that it was probably going to stick in man. So I switched to a basic deep ball type play at a gun ace twins. They didn't even go cover zero. But I felt the heat from this guy right here. And I had to get out of the way. I had to run for my life a little bit. And I, he threw it off his back foot, too. Just a crazy throw. And somehow, some way, the big guy makes the big play. Awesome play. Wow, just craziness. All right, we got to score a touchdown down here. There's just no ifs, ands, or buts about it. 
Let's do a screen. And they're going zone at least. So the clock is running. We're going to let it do so. Get it down to a couple seconds. We're going to go to Biggers. Great play there. And I'm going to run the exact same play. And they're, I figured they'd go goal line, to be honest. But they're going zone at least. I'm going to just leave it as he is. They may shift some more guys over. The clock has stopped, so we'll go ahead and snap it. Ah, dang it. Dang it, dang it. I wonder what happens. Mm, we're not going to take a chance. I, I'd rather do something from here. We're going to go slim. We're going zone. And if I don't convert this, I feel like I have no need by the no choice but to go for a field goal. Clock has stopped. Ah! Six points! Barely got in. Just enough. I saw the one hole and I crept right on in to get six points. So somehow, some way, we're tied with Notre Dame in the third quarter. So no matter what happens in, from here on out, I'm proud of the team for what they've done so far. And he tacks on the extra points. We, you know, we kept at it. So while we're here, let's try to win this thing. Might as well. So we're going to go back and kick this thing. Kick it high. Hopefully he'll fair catch it. Or fumble it. Drop it. Not with the impact guy. He won't. We're going to go back to Dime. Because that's our best 11. Let's see what they're doing here. I thought they were... Okay, yeah, never mind. Make a play, somebody. Gala Shaw had to come all the way over across the field to make the tackle. The staying quarters are going five wide. I think I got two wide receivers on my side. Somebody make a play except for that guy right there. Ooh, he short-armed it. So neither quarterback is throwing the deep ball well at all. Like, we've completed one out of seven <laughs> between both quarterbacks. Yeah, short. Ooh. That was close. That was to Jeff Samarja, by the way. So a second and ten, they're doing a big set. So we will go with a dog gold. I know we got a bunch of skinny cornerbacks out there, but those are our best players. And said they was going... Three tight ends, and then they have a tight end out of wide receiver or something. Get him! Sack! Nice! Under front. The other Jake Owens. So we're going to... We're going to do a cover three. I'm going to go after the quarterback myself. Hopefully he doesn't convert a 16-yard play here. Ah, just way too easy. I had to pick something. What I may try to do on a similar situation is I may control a linebacker or a corner instead. And maybe I could bait him and throw it in my direction. And I pressed the wrong button. Think it, think it, think it. Keep pressing the wrong button. I'm so used to going back and forth between some this one and like 09 and such. I'm still sticking with quarters. I may have to go back to nickel now since I get him. Get a few yards there. Uh, hmm. I'm going to do a lightning too. I'm going to think I, they should have both tight ends on one side and they are. So we're going to just take a chance. I'm going to go right here. Sack! Ah, it worked! Go back and look at this. We know by now that pretty much all of their 12 personnel sets have two tight ends on the same side, as you see right here. They're on the left. 
So that means I don't mind trying to do a zone blitz of some sort on the opposite side. And it worked. I waited. I was patient on the right side to let my defensive end distract the tackle so I can go around him. And we're able to get the sack. Great play. Good defense. So now we're going to go back to dime. I want to throw a... Mm, I'm, mm, let's do... I'm going to do a dog two. I'm going to control the middle linebacker. I'm not going to blitz. Ah, he got in anyways. I still got my hand up, and he still got the first. Look at this. Ah, he got right in front of it. He threw a bad pass in order to get the first down. Ah, dang it. So it says you're going two wide receivers, three tight end. But it looks like they'll go back to one of their 12 personnel sets. So I'm going to go with just a basic one high. I had to come all the way across the field to make the tackle. All right, fourth quarter. We're tied, but they're fixing the score. But either way, we've played just as good as football as we can ask for for the situation. I'm going to pick a hole and go with it. Ah, it went the wrong way. We didn't. We stopped them at the goal line. We're going to go with all that slant blitz to see what happens. Somehow, some way, he's not getting in. <laughs> Fourth and goal. Please kick a field goal. Please. Thank you. Thank you, thank you. Jeez, what a game. Craziness. Gosh, I want to beat them so badly. That would be so huge for our program. The upset of the century. I mean, it would be big time stuff right there if we can. So, okay, we're down a field goal. Let's get on offense and run as much clock as we can, get down the field and score a touchdown. Let's see if Gal Shaw can do something here. Look at that closure, just killer. So we are on the left hash. I'm gonna flip this. I'm trying to think of, no, let's uh, let's leave it. Let's do a screen. We're going zone, we'll go to biggers. Terrible throw, he got bogged down. Just not a good play at all. Second and 11. I want to go back to, it's on my mind. I want to go back to halfback angle. We're going man. This is going to go to somebody on the right. Please bring both safeties. I dare you. Otherwise, we got to go to Loom, and I don't know if CT can make that throw. We're going to find out. As long as they don't go cover zero. We're going with that clock roll. They're bringing both safeties. I can't believe it. Go, son! Get it! Get it! Ah! Ah! What a stud! Great throw by CT. By far his best throw of the night. Awesome play. So the clock will be going. Let's try. Let's do slam. Let's run the ball once at least. We're going man. I'm going to try, let's go to the left, just because we got JSA on the left. Hopefully he can block for us. We ran into a couple seconds. Look at the closure there. I'm just trying to, just can't. Just good play all around by the defense. So we didn't gain anything there. I want to, I'm going to go back. It's just on my mind. Let's just go back to halfback angle. We're going man again. We're going to let that clock run. 
They're going cover zero. I can't believe it. Oh my gosh. Keep doing it. Man, we got it. If we could convert this, this may be a touchdown. I think we're close enough to get a touchdown on this play. I called it! Six points! Get it! Ah! 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 We didn't get the six, but we got the big game. So where are we? We are on the four yard line. What I want to do, that's on my mind. We're going to flip gun trips and we're going to go to our screen. I want to give that to our tight end. We're using the tight end sub package. That's how I'm able to get him in there. And then when you flip it, I may have to go ahead and snap this. Terrible throw. Oh, my gosh, he's going to score. Woo! Oh, wow. That was overwhelming. Go back and look at this. This is incredible. Oh, gosh. I just, okay, here's, here's what I was thinking. Here's what my plan was. I wanted to give John St. Louis the ball back. I wanted to see him get the touchdown. I felt like he deserved it. So I want to give the ball to him. They're going man. Now, normally on a trips formation like this, sometimes the defense will shift all of their man defenders over to that far side, making it obvious, hey, we're not going to let you go to that side of the field. The clock is running. So I wanted to run the clock, but since they were going man, I was afraid they was going to send everybody and their brother to the left side, like those two linebackers or at least two of the three, maybe even that other safety. just kind of depends on who's – Defending who? So I went ahead and snapped it. Not the best throw because he had to come back for it. Somehow we get blocks everywhere we needed to go, though. Look at the block. Oh, both two blocks are amazing. And he gets the touchdown anyways. That's incredible. Oh, my gosh. We got a lead on Nora Dame late in the fourth quarter. Let's finish it. Let's do this. We need a program-changing win. Tonight's the night to do it. Tonight, we, we got to get this. Show the world that Murray State, when it in time, is coming. So we're up four. Two and a half to go. We're going to get back on defense. And keep playing good defense. Our defense is playing amazing tonight. Somehow, somehow we're playing better defense today than we get against like Kent State and Akron. Doesn't make any sense, but it is what it is. So we're going to go back to dime. I want to... I don't see it. We'll do dog two. I want a zone blitz. I should have... They don't have one from the nickel. I'm, I'm taking a big gamble here. There's nothing in the middle. And that's what I have to... Get him somehow. Get him. That could have been much worse. They keep it on the, ground and they have the only nickel the blitz I saw was the, the, the fire two blitz, and I didn't really like that. So we'll go to one high. I'm guessing they're going to run here. They seem determined to run it. They went with a slant run, and he got the first anyways. All right, go into passing mode, I dare you. We're going to go here, and we're going to go quarters. Please throw in my direction. I want you to throw in my direction. We're going to do an over front. Play action. Ah! Ah! Woo! Oh, my gosh. Do you believe in miracles? We may see one tonight. Gosh, what a play that was. Let's break this play down. Let's look at this replay first. Oh, my gosh. I don't know what to think. Let's go back and look at this. Dang it, I didn't hit the instant replay button quick enough. Okay. You see me over there on the left. I want him to throw in my direction, and he does. Look over here. Look at that a little bit better. And he's going to this guy right here. And I get in front of it, and I bob it down, or I, and he gets he gets an interception. It's just craziness. What do you do? I just, oh, such a huge play. Okay, it is. We are there. Let's go back. I want to, we need to run the ball. I just hope our running backs don't fumble it. That, that's the only thing that worries me. Otherwise, I'd give them the ball a whole lot more. But we're going zone. We're going to run to the left. Big play by Odoms. Ah! Go back and look at this. Look at the big gaping hole right here. So it's obvious I'm going to go in that direction. 
But look at the blocking. Incredible blocking. Gaping hole on the B-gap. First down. Huge. We force a timeout. We are going to go backfield. Uh, yeah, that's fine. We're going to stay here. I'm not going to do any tosses because I'm afraid we may do a bad pitch. So we're going to do draws and slams, and we're going to do screens. Hopefully, we can complete the play the, the plays on the screens, so we don't have any incompletions. We're going to run to the left again. Oh gosh, that was a hit and a half. Uh, they called another timeout. We're going to go backfield again. I want Odom's to still run the ball here. We're going to go halfback direct. They're going zone. Nickel. And they're shifting that way. Uh, let's just stick with it. See what happens. Big play. Almost a first down. 30 inches. The clock is running, and they're not calling a timeout. I am going to let Rocky run this one. Only because... Odom's looked a little gassed on that one. So we're going to just let this clock run. Get a first down here. And I, I don't know. I may poop my pants. I don't know. We'll see what happens. No promises. Because they how many timeouts they got left? They just got one timeout left. Get a first down here and end this thing. Oh, I didn't get it. I didn't. Oh, he got it. But he got hurt. Game's over. Game is over and the miracle has happened. Oh, wow. It just now occurred to me. The game's over with. Oh, jeez. QB Neal victory formation. Oh, wow. We just beat Notre Dame. We beat Notre Dame at home. Oh, at, at South Bend. We beat them in South Bend. Oh, my gosh. This is the, the game-changing, program-changing type game you need. Thankfully, Lane is out only for a couple quarters. I keep calling him Rocky Lane. It's, it's Ron Lane. It's Ron Lane, not Rocky. Either way, okay, it's just, I'm trying to keep it under control here, keep it civil. And I just, we just beat Notre Dame. Wow. Please, for the love of God, do not have the electricity go out on me. I got to say this as soon as possible. Oh, my gosh. We just beat Notre Dame in South Bend. Mm. And we're going four and five. Mm. Somehow, some way, we beat these guys. And there it is. Wow. I can't tell you if I've had a bigger upset win than that one right there. I know they're four and four. They're not the best, but they're a, a really talented team. Wow. I'm just trying to compose my thoughts. I don't know what to say. But Murray State just beat the Golden Domers. Oh, geez. Incredible. Ah! And no, I did not poop my pants. So... Okay, let's go to the stats and scores really quick. Neither team offensively got to do a whole lot, but I, I ran so much clock, or at least as best as I could. I'll tell you what helped us more than anything, as we ran the ball as good tonight as we've ever had. Just looking here. Getting a few sacks on Brady Quinn helped. They had three, it's the turnovers. They had three interceptions. What's crazy is... The Akron quarterback in the last game played so much better than Quinn did here. I mean, we couldn't stop the guy. I mean, I forgot what his percentage was, but it was insane. Just a great game by him. Yet somehow today, we just, we outplayed him. I don't know how. Insanity. Go look at the individual stats. He went 10 for 16, but you can't turn the ball over against me. I can eventually take advantage of it. Eldridge, 19 to 27, one touchdown, the one pick, he short-armed it. But a lot of that stuff was screens. If you throw short stuff, you can get high completions. And I feel like the screen passes are the easiest way for a quarterback to get going. They should not have too hard of a time making bad throws on those, even though he made several today. But Odoms, nine, of, nine attempts, 69 yards, 7.6 yards average. 
He was the MVP of the day. I didn't see who actually got it earlier. It may have been Odoms. I didn't pay attention. But he just had an amazing game. John St. Louis, seven receptions, 122 yards. Look at everybody else. Biggers had seven receptions for 11 yards. A lot of that stuff was off the screens where just nothing really produced there. But John St. Louis, he's 6'5", 250. He's a matchup nightmare for any linebacker or safety. That's why you have you see me have him going deep all the time. It's a jump ball situation. It's like Wilt Chamberlain going up against Muggsy Bogues half the time. It's just an obvious thing to do. It's just go over the top and let him, you know, handle the jump ball situations. And he done that great today. Just incredible. What a game. Blocking Westbrook, I thought switching to the dime package probably saved our game if you think about it. Once... Uh, what's his face? Once the other Owens went out, I had no choice but to go dime. And that put our best 11 guys out there, believe it or not. At least we got some speed out there. Oh my gosh, my head hurts. You go look at the box score. So, I mean, we took look at the score. It just gradually got better for us as the game went on. Zero points, three, seven, and seven. Incredible. What a game. Let's get out of here. Let's save this thing. Thankfully, neither one of those two injuries are severe. They'll be back for the next game. We got Middle Tennessee State coming up, if I'm not mistaken. I don't want to save it yet. Uh, MTSU, we got another bye week since we don't recruit in season this year. I'll just skip that so you don't have to see any of that. But we do have MTSU coming up. And yes, they're 2-5. and five. We may have a chance. Hey, if we can beat a B-plus Notre Dame, we can beat a B-minus MTSU if we play well enough. All right, guys. I hope you enjoyed that as much as I did. Come on back, and I'll talk to you later.